This is amazing. The FDA has approved Nephi, the first needle-free epinephrine spray for treating anaphylaxis, which is a life-threatening allergic reaction. Instead of carrying a traditional needle-based EpiPen, you can now get the same medication through a nasal spray. If you're pre-med, please pay attention to this. These products are the results of scientists, pharmacists, doctors, all coming together to innovate. And the students med schools accept today, that may be you, we know are these same people who are going to drive that exciting future of medicine forward. So get a head start and start thinking about the impact that you want to make in your lifetime. No one's going to hold it to you. And no, I'm not saying you need to revolutionize medicine in your college dorm, but you should start wondering if maybe you want to be an academic professor. That pre-med may look for more teaching and mentorship experiences. Or if you plan to be a doctor advocating on Capitol Hill, that pre-med may benefit from grassroots advocacy work or become a physician that consults on projects like Nephi. And that pre-med would benefit from an internship at a biotech startup. Because these careers and these levels of impact require certain skills developed over time, say computer science or economics or biotech experience, you should get a head start by trying to integrate them into your application early. Med schools know that when they graduate doctors, the goal is to take care of patients and put their communities first. But how you do it will differ from doctor to doctor. And so to build a competitive application, one question that has helped me is what type of doctor will you become? The doctor entrepreneur? The doctor social justice politician? The doctor community health advocate? That's what the modern doctor looks like. And if you're not sure how to build that application, that's exactly what our mentorship program does. If you're looking for more information, check out the link in bio.